Hey there geeks, Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to remember your Windows locations with multiple monitors in Windows 11 and here is the beauty of it. You don't have to do anything. If you've never had dual monitors before Windows 11 came out, what would happen is anytime you have a window somewhere else, there's my email over here, whenever you have a window somewhere else and you go to sleep and you come back, the next thing you know, all your windows are back over here on one screen. You're dragging everything around and it's a pain. There are third-party apps which can handle that for you. We'll discuss that in just a minute because there's a reason why you might want to just check your settings. So if all you want out of life with multiple monitors is just remember your window position, once Windows 11 is installed, forget about it. But let me show you where it's at just in case. Start. Settings. You should be in system by default. And you want to look for display right here on your right. And aside from other settings like extending, showing M1, duplicating, here is multiple displays. As you can see, remember window locations based on monitor connection. Now, that should be on by default. As I said, you don't have to do anything. Now, here's the rub. What if you're using a third-party tool like, let's say, dual monitor tools? That has a million options built in. Let's see if I can get it to open. There we go. As you can see, there's nothing easy about it, in my opinion, it's why I kind of avoid it. All I wanted to do was get the dual monitors to remember where I left it. But instead, you have 4,000 options. So I know people love it. So take it with a grain of salt. I hated it. Doesn't mean it sucks. Not at all. People love it. Dual wallpaper, swap screen dual snap there's a lot of cool stuff in there and there's other apps that work as well this one's open source it's free and people swear by it there's a couple others they swear by as well but that's the other thing you want to consider if you're using a third-party utility and you're happy with it because you want to do more than just remember your window location you may consider coming in here and unchecking that so that you're sure that your software isn't conflicting with it I don't think it will but if it was me I would probably uncheck it just to make sure your software is managing it correctly. It's a little early to know for sure, but again, the beauty of this is I love it. I immediately tested it out. I've been using it for 24 hours at this point. It has not yet failed me. My windows are where I left them. I'm so happy. And there you have it. It's not that hard anymore to remember your window locations with multiple monitors in Windows 11. Woo. All right. There you have it. We appreciate you watching as always. Don't forget to check if you want that dual monitor tools. Um, bup, bup. Type it in Google, dual monitor tools, major geeks, or check the video description for a link to this article and you can click right through whatever's good for you. All right, let's try this again. Thanks for watching. As always, see ya.